What is good, everybody? Man, it's your boy Jay in the building. We is back again with another video. Okay, so yesterday we did Bethune Cookman uh, recruits. Today we are doing Alabama State. Now we're gonna do, I think, probably three or four videos for Alabama State. So, and I just picked some guys, and I'll be honest with y'all. I think Alabama State collectively is my sleeper team of the year. I don't know yet. Depending on their schedule, I got to wait until their schedule come out. And depending on what goes on around the swag. But yeah, Alabama State is, is my sleeper team for the year. But in this video, we got Roderick Daniels, defensive end out of, uh, out of Mississippi. Uh, he is a transfer from Northwest Mississippi Community College or whatever. And he was an All-American at the JUCO level. And he is now heading to Alabama State. Good thing because them them losing Christian Clark is a big loss. First team all conference in the SWAC. So they needed somebody to replace him. So hopefully he get the job done. Without further ado, let's get the video started. Let's go ahead and see what's happening here. Let's see what's going down. Okay. Dog, he just beat the double team. Off first the first play. He beats the double team. Okay, we see you. Hmm, got it. Okay, we like that. Oh, yeah. Come off the edge. Come here. Mm hmm. Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah. Three straight sacks. Hmm, okay. Come here. Four sacks in a row. Okay, we see you. We see you. Off the edge. Oh my goodness. Yeah, he was. Yeah, oh boy, it was too. He's too slow for him. He's too slow for him. Coming off the edge. Ooh. Oh, and he got he got the force fumble. With the force fumble. Come here. Mmm. Yo, every yo, that, that, that's like six sacks in a row. I like I like him already. I, I, I like him already, okay. Okay. Come here. Come on. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, and he gets back there. Okay. He gets back there. He, he, he just puts him back with another sack. Mm, come here. Uses his hands. Another sack. Oh yeah, come here. Bro, that's like 10 sacks in a row. Oh, come here. I, I didn't see that color so much. I already know it's Jones College. I, I, I didn't see that color so much. Psst. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yeah. Get him. Get him. Oh, with the force fumble. <laughs> Dog, he is out there making plays. You, I like how he, he uses his hands. Mm, come here. Use your hands. Okay. Come on. With the quarterback pressure. Forces a pick. Like how you read the screen, okay. Tackle for loss. He he ain't get blocked at all. Hmm. There you go, okay. That look like that hurt. That like that hurt. Okay, what do you use the hands with the quarterback pressure? I mean he still caught the ball. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. I told y'all, man, look. I think Alabama State is my sleeper team of the year. I think they had a decent team last year. They're not losing too many players. I think uh, I think they have all of their receivers coming back. Their quarterback is coming back. They're losing Israel Gray. And that's somewhat of a big loss. But he wasn't even the leading rusher last year. Not surprisingly, so... I don't think it'll make that much of a difference. But I like where Alabama State is headed. But that East Division is, man, it is it's tough. That East Division is absolutely tough. Come here. Oh, yeah. Come on. Give me that. All that. Give me all that. We see you. Mm-hmm. He just he pushes him back with one hand. 
He pushing him back with one hand. Come off the edge. I'm about to say the runner. Did the running back not see him? Oh, no. I'm about to say. And he forced the fumble. Off the edge. Hey, he he kind of fast off the edge though. I ain't go front. He come he he come a little quick off the edge. It's how you use his hands. Got yeah, got dip a little more though. I seen a few video a, a few highlight tapes where I seen the the DN kind of kind of uh get skinny around the edge. Okay, we use the hands. Okay. Yeah, I just think that matchup with uh, Alabama State and Alabama A and M. that may go. I ain't gonna lie with you. Like I'm not gonna lie. Like I see how everybody is all like up and wild about how many recruits Alabama A and M has. Uh, I don't know. That's gonna be enough to. Do something in the conference this year. I don't know. Like I don't. I don't know. But I think Alabama and them have the toughest schedule in the conference. Like they have a tough schedule. I I just can't wait for Alabama State schedule to come out because I don't know that that uh Magic City Classic is gonna be interesting to watch. It's gonna be real interesting to watch. So I, I can't wait for that. Get tackled. There you go. Mm -hmm. There you go. He has great look. He, he knows how to use his hands, though. Like that's one good thing about him at the end. And come oh come. Mm, I'm about to I'm about to say that's a good hit. I was kind of, I was kind of a slow developing play. Jones playing against Jones College. That's the same quarterback that's um, headed to Gremlin. And somebody said in the comments that Mississippi has the best, the best JUCO system. I look. I can't really argue that, but it sounds like he has a great argument. I I done seen so many people, you know, just coming from Mississippi JUCOs and heading to the SWAT schools. So he might have a point. He might have a point with that. What are you doing? What are you doing? Come here. Oh, okay. Hmm. Oh man. Go on the edge. That would see that. That would see that. Okay. That would see that. Mm, come here. I just hope that he, you know, is he gonna be the guy to replace Christian Clark? Okay, that's some big shoes to fill. I think Christian Clark is heading to the um the the, the a legacy bowl. Matter of fact, in the legacy bowl is happening. Not this weekend, but next weekend. Like it, it's happening in two weeks. Oh, uh oh, come here. Mm, come here with the tackle. Hmm. He he aggressive coming off the edge though. Like I ain't gonna front. He looks strong. <laughs> he he tried to pitch it. Okay, I like him. I just hope, you know, is he going to be that guy, you know, to to do some damage in the swag this year? We'll see, man, because the swag is already loaded. Like, the swag is loaded this year. So, we're going to see what happens with that.